Hello and welcome back to another computer sluggish tutorial. So in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to remove the background of this image. Okay, so on the right hand side as you can see we've got quite a few layers. So first things first, if you remember from my other video, my part two one, this layer eight if I just get my move cursor tool up here look so you've got your move selected pixels so we're just going to move him here as you can see our layer 8 is to move the sniper guy about so let's just undo that move quick by going control and Z right so Obviously, we've selected our guy, and now we're going to go down to the background, and we are going to simply just go to the top left hand corner here and drag our cursor all the way across, or you can simply go Control and A to select tool, and we're going to go Delete. Okay, and as you can remember, we've got layer six and so we're just going to delete those two layers as well so now as you can see we've got a transparent background okay so if I just select layer A and just tidy them up a little bit so we're going to get our little um, eraser tool here so shortcut key is E obviously if you hover over these tools you can see what the shortcut key is okay there, right so let's just tidy them up a little bit okay so hold control and use your mouse wheel to zoom in more okay right you can obviously change the hardness of the eraser tool little bit there Let's get that bit I think that looks pretty good we'll see you're going to a lot more detail than what I am at the moment this is only a little rough okay okay you could end up spending quite a while doing this. Right. Okay, so let's just erase this bit here as well. Just go like that very quickly. Okay. So as you can see, the grey and the white squares in the back, that's transparent. So if I was to select him and copy him onto another project, and say if it was a blue background, then these grey and white boxes, they would turn into, obviously, the colour of the background. Okay, so I'm going to now show you that. Okay. Right. So if we just remove all that, oh. right, just move these windows over quick, just tidy this little bit up. It's annoying me, as you can imagine. Okay, so that's a bit more tidy. Right, that's a lot better. Right. Okay, so we got a little guy there. So we're now going to select our background. So it's a transparent background, and we're going to select our gradient tool. So gradient, what that does is it merges like two colors across like the screen. 
okay so it can go from like you can have the color go from let's say so down there our primary let's have it blue and our secondary you can also use trop down here secondary let's just have it green so what the gradient is going to do is make it go from blue to green okay so as so you can see if i drag down there you go it's going from blue to green and obviously you can choose which direction you want it and how you want it to go so there we go we've got a nice blue to green gradient going on there for our background okay and that is it that is how to obviously remove a background and to keep an image so that's how you change the color of your background okay so now whilst we're at this we are going to create another new layer above our background but now we're going to apply a border around our image okay so we're going to go back to our rectangle tool like we had earlier and we are going to select draw field shape okay and I want my border color to be select my primary I want it to be what color will go well with all that I reckon a, a slightly dark green okay so I'm just simply just going to cover it all in my green. Okay. And obviously now that's applied. But where I've got a new layer, it's not applied it to the background. So if I check that, there's our original background. Okay, so we're going to now go to, um, display rulers. Okay, so as you can see, we've input a ruler around the outside now. Okay, and we are just going to go to about there, I'd say. It's on your ruler, look at where you are. Okay, so match the height and length. Okay, and also it tells you down the bottom anyway what area you got selected. Okay, so we're just going to go to there again and we are going to go to about there I'd say okay so it's only going to be a small little border so make sure you've got the correct layer selected and we're just going to simply go delete and there you go okay so also if we got our pink border bit okay so the pink border we are now going to drag below that layer right and there you go so the green border has gone above that layer now okay and there you go that is an easy way of how to do a border and also an easy way of changing the color of your background Hope this tutorial helped, remember to hit that like button and subscribe for more tutorials.